Yes, maybe. Yeah. yeah. Asturias. Yeah. yeah, because I've been studying, uh, uh, you know, Spanish history. So I, uh, I know this uh, area. So anyway, we are Muslim, we love Spain. There's so much history yeah. there, you know, even Muslim history. And of course, even I, I would love to go to Spain, you know. Oh, no, it's, a, it's a nice place. So anyway, so you said before you were a Catholic Christian yeah. in yeah. Spain. Like my father, my mother, they should. Yeah. But we never read the Bible. Because I know in Spain, they are majority Catholic Christian. Yeah, majority, and in yeah. pa Portugal, uh, also, they are yeah. majority and Catholic Ita Christian. Italian as well. Yeah, Italian. And uh, I know that, you know, Catholic Bible has uh, 73 books. Yeah, 73 books. 66? No, 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 no. Uh, Catholic Bible has 73 books. Oh, yeah. But now you are a Protestant, yes? And your uh, Protestant Bible has 66 books. Why? Because in the year 1611, okay, in the year 1611, just over 400 years ago, they took out seven books from the Bible, the Protestants, you know, Martin Luther, who was a German, Martin Luther King, he took away seven books from the Bible, so then they have a Bible with 66 books. And of course, this Bible with 66 books is the Protestant Bible, all right? But before yeah, but, that... But, you know, the Catholics, they wrote things which is the reason also as I'm going to be in the New Testament. They wrote a lot of things in the Old Testament. So, in the New Testament. okay, thank you for uh, telling me that uh, yes. information. So are you saying in the Catholic Bible, they have written something... Uh, are wrong. I think so. so in the Catholic Bible, you are saying they have written some things there which uh, are not from God. Well, I don't know the Catholic Bible, but I'm talking about the Catholic. Yeah, because they believe in the Catholic Bible, so they read but the Catholic Bible. The Bible is only one, I think. No, Bible is different. But I'll tell you, you know, there's a Russian Orthodox Bible with 86 books. Then there is a Greek Orthodox Bible with 78 books. They are also Orthodox, but Greek Orthodox Bible, 78 books. Then in Africa, we have a country by the name of Ethiopia, used to be known as Abyssinia. And in, the, in Ethiopia, in Africa, they have the Orthodox Tivahedo Bible, but in their Orthodox Tivahedo Bible, they have 81 books. Then we have the Catholic Bible. Yeah, I'm telling you, I know that, you know, I've been studying the Bible long time. And then we have the Catholic Bible, which has 73 books, and your Protestant Bible, which has uh, 66 books, yeah. you know. And also, there are other Bibles as well. So, in other words, in the world today, there are different Bibles with different number of books. But you know, I, I don't believe many people who call Christian, I don't believe them. What did you say? I don't believe many people who call Christians. They don't know what they say. Okay. They believe in Jesus, yes, but they believe in the law of God is abolished. Okay. They believe in the they don't believe in the commandments. Ah, they don't believe in the commandments. No, they say it's abolished. And I don't do you believe, believe in the commandments? I do, yes. Okay, you know there's a commandment in the Bible, in the Old Testament, in the book of Deuteronomy, yeah. chapter six, verse four. Where the Prophet Moses, the Prophet Musa Isra, Moses, peace be upon him. He says, in the book of Deuteronomy chapter 6 verse 4, the Prophet Moses, peace be upon him, says, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one. Is one. So Moses did say, the Lord our God is one in three, three in one. But he said one. Brother. Is that true? One, one means united when they talk about God and Jesus is union like the, 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 the married the married man and woman they say it's only one but there is two married talk, man and woman yeah the, the Bible says it's one but then there is two who is two God no the Bible say marriage people are only one but it's the husband and wife is two now we're talking about God so God what? Is, is Jesus is God too you know this is God yeah. Okay. God, yes. uh, okay. 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 Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let, the, let the lady speak. Okay. Okay. So we say Holy Quran is from Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Do you believe that your Christian Bible is from Jesus? It's from Jesus. 
Well, it's word from God, yes. Okay, okay. And we Muslims believe in our Holy Quran. As a Christian, do you believe in your Bible? Oh, yes. You do? Okay. Yes, I Can do. I give you a verse from your Bible? Okay. In every Christian Bible, doesn't matter how many books there are in that Bible, but in every Christian Bible, in the New Testament, in the first book of Corinthians, chapter 14, verse 34, in the Bible it says, women should remain silent in the churches. In the church, because the man is the one who gives the message. Can I finish? Sure. Thank you very much. Uh, I'll just finish this word and I'll let you speak, okay? So, in every Christian Bible, in the first, in the New Testament, in the first book of Corinthians, chapter 14, verse 34, in the Christian Bible it says, women should remain silent in the churches. That's in the church in Corinth in the first century. Not I'm today. reading your Bible. Don't interrupt. For, Respect your Bible. It doesn't apply for all time. Respect your Bible. That doesn't apply to everyone. Respect your Bible. I'm telling you that it doesn't apply to If everyone. someone reads a verse from the Holy Quran, I would listen quietly. In Corinth, at that time, there were a group of women who were being disruptive. Are you Christian? Excuse me. Excuse me. Are you Christian? You know very well that Respect your Bible. I'm reading your Bible. You so quiet. 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 Okay. Sorry about that, viewers. I'm speaking to the Christian lady and the Christian gentleman behind started talking. Okay. Anyway, so respect your Bible if you're Christian. So again, in every Christian Bible, in the New Testament, in the first book of Corinthians, chapter 14, verse 34, in the every Bible it says, women should remain silent in the churches. They are not allowed to speak, but must be in submission as the law says. Now, next verse, which is first book of Corinthians, chapter 14, verse 35. It says, women, if they want to inquire about something, if they want to talk about something, inquire about something, they should ask their own husbands at home. They are believers. If they are hold on, hold on, hold on. Please, let me read the verse and I'll give you a chance. Okay. So, first book of Corinthians, chapter 14, verse 35. Next verse, he says, Women, if they want to inquire, ask about something, inquire about something, they should ask their own husbands at home. The Bible says, For it is disgraceful for a woman to speak in the church. Well, I believe a man should speak in the church, yes. So, but, just a minute, but women can help. Women can help? Yes. Can, okay. Can when, help or in the church or in everywhere. Okay, thank you but very I, much. I believe in the, 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 in the church should be a man. This is what I believe. Thank you very much. So when you said women should help men. Yeah, it will help, yes. So, can, so, so if those women, uh, you say, can help, can those women speak in the church? Well, I don't know in the church, but they can speak. You don't in, know. Uh, maybe they can. I don't know to help. No, the Bible them. says they cannot speak in well, church. I, I, can't, I, I don't have that answer anyway. I'm you don't have the answer. No. You better become a Muslim. But, no, no, no. No, because but, the, no, but the thing no. is, I know. I believe. I believe in the man. The man. I think the lady's got speak. an answer to your question. Excuse me, we, I know her years. Okay, okay, uh, no, 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 you talk. Oh, she starts talking, she won't stop. Oh, Madam, Madam, yes, yes. Uh, yes. I've trained people. Yeah, I'm educated. Don't worry about I'm that. I'm I don't. Uh, yeah, okay. But you don't know her. I know her. I now she starts talking. So she won't. Sir. Pardon? You don't know me. But you're not a referee, are you? No, Madam, let's talk. Madam, let's talk. Can't you see? I'm British. And you're wearing glasses. You can't see a British. Uh, madam, why are you going away? Yeah, I, I, uh, she needed help because I read to her in the Bible it says women cannot speak in the church. And if they want to say something, the Bible says women should ask their own husbands at home. Why? The Bible says for it is disgraceful for a woman to speak in the church. And uh, just one verse and the lady is gone.